Hi, I would like to give you a brief overview of the violin and the history of the instrument. The, in the instrument was first created in the 16th century, and we have paintings by uh, Guadagnino Ferrari in the 1530s, and he his, his violin only had three and three strings, but the the modern violin has four. So the instrument has developed over the last several hundred years, um, and it's very different today as, as it compared to what it was like then. The bow, for instance, um, you'll see that the wood has a dip in the middle, but the Baroque bow, which was around about 300 years ago, actually goes like this. So the wood would have had an opposite curve to it. Um, and the reason why they changed that is because with a, with the wood going in this direction, you don't have as much power and you can't put weight on the string. So you would have a very weak sound. So they changed the, the Baroque bow to the classical bow in the 1700s to allow the, the violinist or the violist or cellist, um, all three instruments would, this would apply to them. Um, it, it would give the instrument, instrumentalist the ability to play um, more intense music, putting more weight and producing more sound, which would project more in a concert hall, um, rather than just playing a small sound, which might only project in a living room setting or a home concert. Um, so the violin itself, the strings are made out of steel. Um, you, you can also make it out of silver or gold. However, in the early, early years of the existence of the instrument, the strings were made out of gut. They're made out of cat gut or um, sheep gut, and they would take the gut, dry it out, and they would wound it really tightly, and then they might wrap something around it, but it might also just be dried gut. So um, you have gut string from the animal, which would um, be drawn from one end of the instrument to the other end and because it was so tight you could put the bow on it to produce a sound um, because if it wasn't tight it would just the string would just sit there in a relaxed position and you couldn't put tension against it the bow is made out of um, wood in the stick but this is actually horse hair um, you don't want to touch it with your fingers because the grease from your fingers will make it so that the, uh, the hair doesn't have any sound to uh, stick to the string. Um, so you, you take horse hair, but then you also take rosin. And rosin is made out of tree sap. And you put this block of rosin, which it's hard, tree sap. It's like a rock. And you rub it against the horse hair, and that's what makes it sticky. So that you can stick to the string. Because without rosin, the horse hair would be, uh, it wouldn't have anything to grab the string with and so you wouldn't get any sound out of the instrument so the rosin enables you to stick and pull sound out of the instrument thank you for watching